Well, Luke, we're all looking uh, for ways to get outside, enjoy ourselves in a safe, healthy way. And there's a lot you guys have to offer, isn't there? Uh, that's right. We, at Three Rivers Park District, we have 27,000 acres of parks across the metro area. Wow. And the opportunity to get out and social distance and just be healthy outside is a great opportunity. You can bike, you can hike, you can bird watch, just some, lots of things you can do to get outside yeah. to really enjoy it. So what are some of the things you guys in specific are, are recommending people do right now to get out, enjoy the outdoors and, and not stay as cooped up as they need to be? Right, in springtime here, as, as the transition changes, snow is melting away, our, our regional trails are opening up. There's lots of places to, to bike all across the regional trails. Our park trails inside, both our non-paved and paved trails are mm -hmm. opening up and people can get out and hike and walk on those. Um, birds are coming back like crazy in the spring. There's lots of good birding opportunities. You can still geocache too, where you can yeah. get an app on your phone. And you can go trace down treasures and all across our parks. Tell me more about geocaching. I've heard of this before. It's not a new thing, but it is pretty cool. Right, so folks now with the GPS abilities on their phones can yeah. download apps and then these apps will let you chase down treasures that are specific spots throughout parks. And it takes you from point to point to get to that place. And then you can leave or take something and leave it. So it's kind of like a fun treasure hunt with it outside in the environment. One of the thing I love about the Three Rivers Parks is that not one of them is the same. That's always so neat that you can get to go to different places and you can get different experiences, right? Regardless of where you go in the metro. That's exactly right. We, we don't want every park to be the same, right? We, we have big open expansive parks like um, Murphy Hanrahan down in Scott County to Crowhassan up in the Northwest Metro, even Highland right in Bloomington. Those are big parks that are really more park reserves, great trail opportunities, great places to hike and do a variety of things. But we also have regional parks like here at French Park, mm -hmm. which is a lot more amenities. We got a lot more swimming and biking and hiking and, and things that you can do around the park. So it's not one size fits all. We have lots of experiences across our park district. Is there anything in specific people need to know right now, given the current climate and state of things before they come to a park? Right now, um, all of our public buildings are closed. So mm -hmm. um, they're closed to the public. So our visitor centers, our nature centers, um, any place we have programs, are closed to the public right now. But we're still encouraging people to come out. We will keep our restrooms open, mm -hmm. so there's some opportunities, so there's some facilities, but we are encouraging people to come out and take advantage of the parks um, across the district. Get their dogs out. You know, we, yeah. all of our trails, all of our paved trails and, and turf trails are all available to walk as long as they you know, use a six foot leash. We, we encourage people to get out and get their pooches out for a walk. It doesn't take long to see people flood the park, does it? As soon as you get a nice day of sunshine a little bit, all of a sudden everybody comes out of the woodwork and shows up. That's right, and, and I also think with a lot of the social distancing and all the remote schooling opportunities that are gonna yeah. occur over the next month, we're gonna see a lot of people coming, trying to find opportunities to get out. And, and the parks, whether it's Three Rivers Park District or your local neighborhood park, or, or state parks, get out and take advantage of them. Uh, can you talk about anything, things that are kind of coming up that people can look forward to this spring into the summer uh, with the Three Rivers Park District? Right now we're still working on whether things will open up and we have to look at that as mm -hmm. the spring comes along. But, but the general kind of passive type things you can do, get out and as we said, the biking, hiking and, yeah. and getting out and getting some good exercise are gonna be the key ones right now. We'll be reevaluating what can open and what we can do um, as, as the coronavirus is, you know, kind of continues on and what changes over time. All right, get out and enjoy your local parks. We've got a lot of great ones here yeah. uh, in the Metro. Thanks so much, Luke. Thanks for having us.